next exercise we're going to do is the single leg sit to stand. Okay? And that's exactly what it is. We're going to use one of our legs to go from a sitting position to a standing position. Sounds easy, doesn't it? <laughs> Let me tell you, any exercise that sounds easy are usually the ones that are toughest. And I'm sure that you already know that. Um, it's always the little movements that get you. That get okay, so when you're going into a sit to stand, obviously posture is really important. You want to make sure that that core is engaged, that chest is high, and you're keeping your arms high so that you can kind of create a little bit of movement through your body. You want to, um, uh, you, you can use your back foot to assist you if you need it, but the idea is to eventually get to a place where you don't really need that back foot, and you can just use that, you can develop that one, that one leg and it's strength and balance. So basically we're going, you're going to dig through heel to midfoot, try and stay off that toe. Um, you're, so you're digging in, heel to foot, core is engaged, shoulders are staying high, coming up into a standing position. Now when you're going down into your sitting position, you want to make sure that you're controlling that movement on the way down, nice soft touch, coming up, and nice soft touch, beautiful, up, and nice soft touch. You should be activating that glute through the whole movement. Okay, here we go up, and then coming down nice and softly, and up, coming down nice and softly, and up, good. You should really feel that firing up, especially on the way down. If you wanna progress this, add some weight. So you're gonna hold some weight, you can hold it on top of your shoulder, you can hold it in front of your body. If you're gonna hold it in front of your body, you wanna hold it right on your chest. Keep it nice and tight, close to you. So exact same movement, coming up. Again, nice and controlled, having a seat. Up, and nice and controlled, having a seat. 